What is up YouTube, Ten Fifty One here, and this is my friend Atomic Chaos aka Matt, and he is playing Domination with me and a couple other friends. It's on firing range, and I recorded this from theater, so that's why the other voices that you'll see were from not this game. Anyway, Matt had a beast game, I had an okay game, but this is about Matt right now, and he just MP5K raped everyone. He had steady aim, I believe, and lightweight. Marathon or Ninja, I'm, I'm not even really sure, but he just raped people. I was going for the flask, going, get, get B, get B, get B, get B, but Matt's like, I'm just going to go around the map and spray everyone, which is what he basically does for almost 10 minutes, and he gets a lot of kills, it's really good. His final score is, uh, let me look real quick, I wrote it down. He goes 59 and 6, that's his final game score, and that's pretty beast, especially on this small of a map where you think you get killed a lot by random grenades and all. No, he somehow avoids them. And he still goes for the win, which is what I like playing with Matt for. Like, he goes for the win, and he does pretty good most of the time. I think he's one of the few people that I can call my equal in sniping, though. If I'm my equal, then he's, like, right there. Because he's pretty good at sniping, too. I don't know about this game. I haven't really seen him do it. But, Mall for two, he's pretty close. <clears throat> Man. Let's talk about me meeting Matt. I met Matt through, I believe, Pruitt on a boat, who's in this party right now. I'm friends with Pruitt, David, and Cavman, and Ross, and they're all, they all know each other, they all talk and all, and I'm real cool with all of them, and I think they're some of my greatest Xbox Live friends, and especially since I don't know them, I consider them better, I guess. I don't know, they're really cool guys, and really chill. Out of all of them, I have the biggest temper. <laughs> Ross is somewhat retarded, not really, but he like acts so stupid, he says the stupidest stuff sometimes, and he, his cats are like naked. David is uh, pretty chill, I don't really know how to describe David, just kind of there. I don't know. David's cool though, David's an awesome guy. Then Pruitt, the football player, the re I don't know if he's in wrestling, no, he's just a football right now. And he's like 6'2", I believe, and he's a red-headed freckled guy who could easily kick my ass. Then again, it's not that hard. And Matt. I've seen pictures of Matt on Facebook. Yeah, I'm Facebook friends with all of them. I know, oh my god, it's so lame. Well, who cares? These guys are pretty awesome. Uh, Matt is about as tall as me, about 5'9", five 5'10". Five he might be 5'8". He's like blonde, brown hair. And he laughs like this a lot. Huh. 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 It's not really a laugh, but like he grunts, like a. Ugh. Anyway, he's really a cool guy, and he really likes MP5 now. And Blake, who was watching the theater game with me, was like, "Why can't my MP5 do that?" Well, Blake, I gotta tell you this: you kind of spray and don't hit him. <laughs> Just kidding with you, Blake. But Matt kind of sprays with steady aim, and that helps a lot. And he gets like six or seven attack helicopters this game. I can barely get my UAV or my spy plane. I'm like, Matt, what the fuck? Are you hogging kills? Seriously? But, nah, it was a great game. <laughs> he just like walks right by Fritos. Wait, that, that wasn't even someone we know. And that, oh, wow. It's weird. The one person that's blue in this game is someone we don't even know. Huh. That's weird. They're like, ah, we don't know him, but everyone else that's green are in a party with us. Anyway, just got home about 15 minutes ago, ate my Taco Bell that I got, my friend got for me, and oh my god, I almost crashed today. We were on one of the main uh, roads in my town, Saginaw, and we were driving, and the car in front of us veered off to go into a left turning lane, you know, that's all fine and all, but they didn't slow down whatsoever, so I thought we were going the same speed in front of us, like the other cars would be going the same speed. No. In, a in less than 100 feet, all the cars were parked and stopped. So I slammed on my brakes. I downshifted. I Oh, my God. It was terrible. We missed the car by a few feet, but still, it was pretty bad. I went from 45 to nothing in, like, two seconds. I had to slam on my brakes. But the tires didn't squeal and or screech, whatever. And that's good. And me and my friend Matt, not this Matt, my best friend real life Matt, we were like, my God, we lived through that? Then we went to Taco Bell. Yeah, that's a great time. And guys, uh, what do you think's better, Valkyrie Rockets or you Spy Plane? I know you're thinking, well, Valkyrie Rockets, they give you kills. But think about it. Valkyrie Rockets suck. They really do. They're hard to control. They, 
fly, they're really hard to control. Yeah, I already said that. They're really hard to control. And I always hit a wall. I don't know about you guys, but I'm always hitting a wall. And when you die, when you fired your first one, you lose that second one. Which I hear they're going to patch, which I really hope they do. Because I'm tired of getting one out, calling it in, getting maybe one killed and dying. And not having that other one, which is probably another kill. So that's kind of a bummer right now, but I hear they're patching it. Treyarch has patched so much in the first month of this game that Infinity Ward ever did in both Modern Warfare 2 or Call of Duty 4, which is awesome. Thank you, Treyarch. I didn't play World of War enough to know how much they patched stuff or whatnot, but they are patching a lot of crap, and I'm glad they are. <clears throat> oh, and tips for using a Valkyrie. Call it in. Wow, he's actually pretty good at that. Call it in straight in the air. Straight up or at an angle, don't call it like vertical or horizontal, my bad, but call it vertical. Then uh, shoot it somewhere and try and veer down and go to where you think they're going to be. Look at, that, look at that. I can't get that. Matt, you freaking hacker. Nah, I'm just kidding. Matt does beast this game. He does, I want to say he does beast every game, but then again, no one really does. But he does very decent almost every game. I think the only time Matt sucks is search. And Matt, I know you're going to watch this eventually. You know it. You know it. You're not really that good at search. You know what? Neither am I. Like, search in this game is fun, but I'm not good at it. But domination, capture the flag, sabotage, demolition, those are the game modes I play and those are the game modes I like. <clears throat> Man. And, oh, uh, Matt got killed by a PM63, which is probably... I think it will probably be the worst submachine gun in the game, but whatever. Ah, man. B, B flag is a death zone for, like, grenades. It's so hard to get without grenades landing near you. That's why I usually use flak jacket on this map, just to survive some grenades to get to where I need to get. And I think I'm capturing uh, C there and going, hey, Matt, come back. Hey, Matt, Matt, Matt. And he just kept running like, oh, screw you, Tanner. Uh. But we captured it. Yeah, that was me. I was capturing it. Do you guys, uh, other YouTube community that watches my clips, do you guys like watching my friends play? Because I did that on Halo Reach, but I think I deleted all those videos off. Actually, they might still be there. I don't know. But I didn't put up those games anymore because no one was really watching them, and Halo Reach was kind of dying because Black Ops was like two days away. So, do you guys enjoy watching other people's gameplay? Because I actually do. I actually like watching some friends' gameplay, seeing how good they did, and like, oh, good job, pat on the back, high five. You're as big a no life as me. <laughs> oh, I have something else to say, which I thought was kind of funny. Today, a uh, friend of mine in class, Curly, uh, that's not his real name. Oh, and that's Ross, by the way, he's gone. That's not his real name, but it's his nickname, everyone calls him that. He, uh,. Came out to me with this, like three pages worth of stupid pickup lines. Like they're so lame that they're kind of funny. And one was, this is my favorite one. Did you just fart? Cause you blew me away. And that was so gay. I was like, oh my god, that's so stupid. I'm totally using that. Now I'm not gonna lie. I didn't like tell any girl that that I didn't know. I was saying it to like friends of mine that I was joking with. Like, hey Megan. She's like, yeah. Hey, did you just fart? Cause you blew me away. <laughs> Sorry, that, I thought that was funny. I had like fun messing with that for an hour. And tomorrow is Friday. Thank God. I can't wait for this weekend. I want to be playing some Call of Duty because I actually haven't been playing much this uh, this week. I mean, I know it's like a normal amount for most people, but for me, playing what I played this week was not at all. I played about two hours a day, which to me is like nothing. I usually play like four five hours I know I know I know no luck but whatever I don't care anymore but yeah just didn't have a crap can't remember I just don't have much time I've been watching a lot of TV that I have like I have a, what do I have DVR I have a DVR U-verse and I've been catching up on my recordings like the event NCIS CSI Family Guy, American Dad, Cleveland Show, all that stuff. I've been trying to catch up on it because I've been so far behind. I haven't been watching any of it. Anyway, that is Atomic Chaos, Matt. He went for the win. He did beast 59 and 6. 
Uh, subscribe to his channel. I'll put it in the description. He doesn't have many subscribers, so please subscribe to him. He won't upload videos, I don't think, but he might. So, it's Tarot 151. That's Matt. Later, guys.